So this question is a diagram question. We see the table provided here. We have an X column, an H of X column. So these are basically all ordered pairs. 2, 7, 4, 11, negative 1, 1. The question says the table above shows selected values for the function H. In the XY plane, the graph of Y equals H of X is a line. What is the value of H of 8? Okay, so obviously H of 8 would be down here somewhere where x equals 8. So we don't know that. We can't just look at the diagram and see what, exactly what that is. Um, so what I could do is figure out what is the linear equation that's formed, um, or what linear equation can I determine using the points that I do have. So I can do that by thinking of this as y equals mx plus b, and that my m is just the change in y values over the change in x values, otherwise known as y2 minus y1 over x2 minus x1. So I can take my y2 here and a y1, and say that becomes 7 minus 1 for my numerator. Do the same thing here for like an x2 and an x1, which would be 2 minus negative 1, because x1 is negative. So I'd have 6 over 3, which is 2. So my slope is 2. So I'd have y equals 2x plus b. And then what I can do is take any one of these ordered pairs and plug them into this equation. I'm going to try the first one and say, well, when x is negative 1, y is positive 1, right? I'm just getting it from here. Again, h of x is y. It's also told to us here. So I'd have 1 equals negative 2 plus b, add 2 to both sides, and end up with 3 equals b. All right, so my equation is y equals 2x plus 3. I got that based upon translating the information in the table. So when the question asks what is the value of h of 8, basically it's saying what does y equal when x equals 8. That's how we interpret that. So I just go straight down here to my equation that I just figured out and say, well, what does y equal when x equals 8? Well, let's just plug 8 in for x. Sorry, plus sign, plus 3. So it becomes y equals 16 plus 3, which is 19. And therefore, the correct answer here is choice B.